That's right. You know what time it is. It's Free Circle Fireside time. Let's get into this, huh? Today we're going to talk about the Robin Hood Syndrome. I like to listen nowadays. I'm finding it a pleasure, a learning experience. Instead of talking all the time, I'm finding it pleasurable to listen to somebody else. Take in all that they have to say. You learn a lot. I was overhearing a conversation today, not meaning to actually overhear, but the people were talking in a manner where there's no way I could not hear what the conversation was about. And it was about the Robin Hood Syndrome. There's a lot of people that think it's okay to take from the rich and give to the poor. It's not okay. There's no justification in that. Well, they said there's this Sherwood forest out there that harbors this band of brothers that want to take the king's gold that the king has been taking from the poor people of the kingdom. It's not rightfully the king's because he took it as taxes. So it's okay to take it back. Well, that depends on how you look at it. If we look on things like because I pay taxes, I can do whatever I want. Society's going to break, and it's going to break rather hard. And that's where we are right now. There's a lot of misinformed individuals what a republic actually means. There's a lot of deluded individuals thinking a republic is a democracy or something other than what it is. Democracies and socialist societies is not a republic. A a majority rules in a democracy where a republic is ruled by law. That's what we are in America. We are a republic. We are ruled by laws. What we have to realize is no individual is above the law. No judge, no lawyer, no doctor, no police officer, no government employee of any type is above the law. Actually, they are servants to the public. So, higher standards should be set upon those individuals. However, the way our system is set up, we've got checks and balances, 
and we should be able to understand it's your right and your duty to start digging into what the law is because the law equates to everybody's guide book in America. So familiarize yourself with proceedings. We need to be able to understand civics. A lot of people don't take time to understand civics. They don't want to talk about religion or politics. But those two guide everything. When we get the mentality of Robin Hood, bad things can happen. We have a social order and a structure that is set up as a republic so it ensures peace, safety, domestic tranquility. There's a lot of people misinformed and no amount of violence taking from others You think you're going to help the poor by taking and stealing. You're going to condemn your soul, my friends. That's what that equates to. You don't want to do that. Stealing is stealing no matter what. Thou shalt not steal. So what we have to do is we have to band together... We have to communicate. We have to push learning, education, understand your civics, your history. If you don't understand history, it's going to repeat itself. All of this fear and anger is being pushed by individuals with Agendas that are not good. We're all brothers and sisters here, and we have to work together. Don't go stealing to help the poor. It's not worth it. So what we can do is we can band together, and we can pool money, and we can logically help people. If a 501c3 is set up and they are taking more in administrative costs than they are helping, do your homework. It's all out there for you to get. If the company is doing good in very low administrative cost, that's where you want to put your money, not into a company that's just there to make money. And if you want to do it over logos and uh, pretty videos that brush over and make up things, I'm telling you, you're giving your money to the wrong people. Find a place that's going to help somebody and their goal is not to build a mansion for themselves. It's up to you to study and research where you apply your funds. That is equally important that you spend your money with companies that help people. We're all twisted up in America. And everybody's getting mad and they want to 
be the Robin Hood. Taking from others will never fix it if the other people are not willing to give. It's got to be a willing thing. And it's only up to you to understand that. So, anyway, the Robin Hood syndrome is not a good thing. Join us, Free Circle. We're building a movement to change these things. We believe in people. People helping people. Email us. We're on all the social media. FreeCircle.website FreeCircle at mail.com These are ways to get in touch with us. Email me your telephone number and a good time to contact you. Let's talk. Maybe you want to be a guest on the show. We'd love to hear from you. Let's start helping people not hindering people. Give a lifting hand. It's time to change what's going on. Thank you for joining us. Join us next time on the fireside. Ed Free Circle, out.